that's what people said about the Jaws franchise after Jaws 3. And just when you thought it was safe to go back to the franchise, this monster swims up and bites you in the ass. And that is just being polite to this pile of dung. Whoever thought that making a Jaws game where you play as the shark itself should have been fed to the creature in question. The only fun to be had here is aimlessly chomping on people, which is what a shark does. However, a shark does not find ID cards on scientists, solve puzzles, or fight giant squids or boss battles of any kind. There is really no story here apart from terrorizing the seaside town of Amity, and that's about it. The missions are aimless and rubbish, and the objectives of these missions, as I mentioned earlier, are like something unpleasant found on the bottom of your ship, which also sums up the game's graphics. And like most crap tie-ins, there's the horrible Jaws MIDI theme to insult you even more. Overall, this game is the exact example of how not to make a tie-in game.